Initially, he was very scared. He was shaking, and it was evident that he was not okay. Some people said they were hearing puppy screams. We couldn't even see him at first. We were driving all that way without knowing what to look for. We were about to leave, and that's when we saw him. We were very happy that he was alive, but he was in a very bad state. Most of his body was covered in dirt. He was severely dehydrated and didn't have any food. Most likely he wouldn't have survived a week or so. We approached him very slowly and we gave him food. Seeing that he was responsive and wanted to eat, this put a smile on our faces and we knew that he wants to live, that he's gonna be okay. Once we got him in the car, we gave him water. This is the first time that I would assume he's in a car. He doesn't know what's going on. He continued to shake. But after about two and a half hours, he was just so tired that his eyes just shut. He literally fell asleep in our laps. It made us feel very good just to see that he could close his eyes and rest. He probably understood that we meant no harm and we just want to help him. Once we got him home, the first thing that we had to do was to wash him. This took a lot of time. He was one of the dirtiest puppies that we had, but he actually behaved very well. Then we dried him off and he became a lot more playful at our home. We just let him explore and he started sniffing around. He started actually waving his tail, which he didn't do before. The vet went well. He was completely different from the day that we found him. He was curious. There was no fear of the vet. The vet told us that uh, within the span of a few weeks, he will naturally heal himself because he's still small. And actually, that's what happened. Uh, after a few weeks living with us, he was running, waving his tail, and no sign of any pain or injury. He is very playful, very curious, and very loving to other small creatures. He got adopted one month after we rescued him. From the moment that they saw each other, they fell in love. Every life matters, and if you see an animal in need, try to help it. If you can't, report it to someone who might.